Sure. Welcome to Start Survey. Without much to your name, you go about each day repeating the same boring tasks. Every day the same as the one before, like flipping an unbalanced coin. However, this time, your unusual pattern will be disrupted as you will find out that not everything as it seems in the midnight zone. Okay, so I guess <clears throat> this is the midnight zone? Ah, kind of a nice room. Could do with some, like, posters or something, or paintings. <laughs> Damn, that's a pretty comfortable bed. No pillows? You're a no pillow kind of person? Really? I can't do that. I need pillows. We got three Rubik's Cubes for. Is that currently my time? Yeah, it is. That's actually currently my time. Okay, I don't think I can pick any of this stuff up. Jesus, it's thundering outside. Alright. Let's just start serving. Are you having a nice day? Uh, me in the game or me in real life? Because... Toggle? What? Whoa, okay. I wasn't expecting... What? Yeah. No, no, let me throw it. Can I throw it? I can zoom in. Oh no, why can I zoom in? I don't like this. I don't like this already. Are you having a nice day? Water? I'm just gonna hold on to you. Uh... Yeah, I mean, me in real life, yeah. I'm having a good day. Do you have many responsibilities? Now I do, <laughs> yeah. Look around for a moment. I mean... Oh my... What? I got a floating bottle. I got a magic bottle. Does my body exist? Am I not sitting on anything? How short am I? This is not a standing desk. This almost looks like a coffee table. Can I... I can't throw it. How do I put it down? Can I even put it down? Let me put down the water. Please. Oh. Press? Okay. I want to put down this bottle. It doesn't matter. Are you familiar with your surroundings? Well, that changed. After I looked away. Um, okay, bed, no pillow. Three Ruby's Cubes. Oh, don't tell me I have to remember this. Is this like an anomaly type game where I have to remember things in my room? I hope not, because I'm terrible at memory games. Uh, I guess I am, as best I can be. Do you know where you are? Well, I'm assuming this is my, my bedroom. Because there's a bed in here. Uh... Yes? What the fuck? I knew it! I knew that was gonna go off! Have you ever had a panic attack? I don't think it was a panic attack, per se. But, like, I went to the store, like, a month or two ago. And that was the first time I've ever had, like, an anxiety attack. I definitely haven't, though. That's the thing. So I'm just gonna say no. Do you find yourself questioning your existence? Uh, that was a thing I did a while back. I haven't really done it that much, uh, as of late. Because I don't really, like... It's not like there's no point in doing it. I think it's like more of like a kind of a fun thing to do is like question your existence. But like it really gets to you if you let it get to you. But uh, do you find yourself... So I guess I do find myself questioning my existence. Not now, but I have. Do you believe there is a god? That's kind of a big question. <laughs> that's kind of a... That's kind of a hot question you're giving me here. Oh my god, is the rain picking up? You stop that rain! I put down- Oh my god, the water is labeled water. 
Do you believe there's a god? Uh, not personally, no. Are you answering these questions out of free will? Well, uh, not... I mean, what is, like, what do you mean by that? Like, am I playing this game right now and I want to make a video out of it? So I have to answer these questions so I can record the video? I could, well, I mean, I, yeah, I am at a free will because there's nothing stopping me from quitting the game right now. So, are you answering these questions? Yeah, I, I'm going to say yes. I uh, feel like I have free will. Are you certain? I mean, I just went over why. So, yes. Anything changed around the room? Do you feel comfortable in your room? I guess so. If the lights went out, would you be scared? Honestly, I would think something, you know, flipped in the breaker. But I don't think like I think I'd be more like, oh. but I don't think I'd be like, oh. I don't think I'd be scared. So no. Hello? I didn't order any pizza. You didn't even knock. Do you have a warrant? Have you ever wondered when will you die? When you will die? I mean, doesn't everybody? I feel like it'd be weird if you've never questioned like how long you you would you're going to live for. You know? Or am I right? Like I always question when I'm going to die. I'm just hoping it's not soon. <laughs> I mean, that's the best I can say. Yes. I don't even know why I was about to say no. Oh, my door is open. <laughs> Have my windows always been open? Dude, I hate it when your mom or dad opens your door and you tell them to close it and they just walk away without closing it. Or like, they'll close it like almost all the way and they'll leave it open a crack and it's like dude are you serious it would have taken like no more energy to close the door all the way have you cleaned off your desk today uh i see I, this is where i can't tell is this is this considering the in-game me or the real life me because no <laughs> my desk is pretty fucking messy like look at it. i got this 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 I got my wallet here and I got some papers and I got like a, a keypad and I got three water bottles and I got a lamp and I got a random flashlight so no in real life me has not cleaned my desk today open the folder on your desk I can do that? What is that? Blush? Do you recognize the contents in the folder? Oh my god! No way it's my fucking blush that I use in videos. Yes? Throw away the contents of the folder? Do you have internet access? Hold on. Hold on, I'm gonna actually delete that from my folder right now. What will happen? It said to delete all the contents of the folder. What if I just pull it out of the folder? What if I don't delete it? What will happen then? Nothing, it has it. What if I move... Here, what if I trick it? I'm gonna try and move everything in that folder out of the folder and into a new folder. I want to see if it likes that or if it's like, oh, good job, you did it. Thank you, you did what I asked. Because if I can trick it that way, then if it's like, see, you don't have free will, you did it. Guess what? I just tricked you. I do have free will and I knew exactly what I was doing. Okay, I just moved everything out of that folder. I want to see if it actually changes anything in the game. Do you have internet access? Uh, yeah. Do you have any enemies? 
No, I don't. Because, I don't know, I have like a moral thing about enemies, and that's like, you can't really be enemies with anybody, because if you were to start being enemies with somebody, just remove them from your life, and then they're not even an enemy anymore. I know that's a lot easier said than done, because people have like a lot of complications with like specific people and things, but like, for me personally, it's not about like, having enemies, it's more like, you just kind of dislike somebody, right? And they might dislike you back. So, but to say like enemies is kind of weird. Like, I feel like that has a completely different like meaning calling someone like your enemy. So no, I don't have enemies. If you suddenly went missing, would anybody come looking for you? Yeah, I feel like a good amount of people would come looking for me. Are you alone? Okay, well someone opened my door, so... My character might not be alone. Me, myself, right now. I'm alone currently in my house, so yes. I'll say that. I'm gonna go based off of me. If you screamed when any- would anybody hear? Probably not. I mean, I scream a lot during, uh, when I stream. And in my videos. Oh, let me try it right now. Ah! I wonder if anyone actually heard that. Uh, no. Do you know the person standing behind you? Yeah, I know him. What the fuck? Are you alone? No. I mean, yes. No. No. Relax. Take some time to relax. Okay. You didn't give me enough time. Hold on, hold on, in through the nose. Out through the mouth. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Are you relaxed? No. Yeah. Are your feelings real and not just programmed like a machine? I feel like, I feel like I'm actually pretty in control of my feelings. What the fuck? I just heard like, I just heard like a light switch or something. But yeah, I actually feel like I'm pretty good at handling my, my emotions. Yes. Is there a meaning to life? Oh, wow. Another big question, huh? Uh, you know, if you really want to get technical, there isn't... I personally don't think there is, like, a meaning, like, as a broad statement. I don't think there's, like, a meaning to life. I feel like everyone is going to grow up... Well, not everybody, but everyone is going to, like... Or, I keep saying everybody. No. A good amount of people, there we go, a good amount of people are gonna like grow up, have kids, and then those kids will grow up and have kids, and then just keeps going, keeps going until something fucks up along the way, you know, like world issues and stuff, or people being against people, and like there being problems in the world, or whatever the hell it is. But I don't think anything that happens has any meaning to it. And now, don't get me wrong, that's gonna sound really depressing, right? But it's a thing where I've actually come to, like, terms with it. And I make my own meaning in life. You have to make your own meaning in life. If there is no meaning to life, as a broad statement, make your own meaning. And that's basically what I want to live by. So, is there a meaning to life? As a broad statement, no. As for my own 
goals and aspirations in my personal life? Yes. So what the- can I just ant- is there- can I just have a maybe button, please? Trash. I can throw stuff away? Why would I throw my Rubik's Cubes away? Actually, I don't need three Rubik's Cubes. Come on, man. Can I throw my laptop in the trash? I can't throw my alarm clock in the trash. Can I throw my bed sheets in the trash? Can I throw my door in the trash? Okay, is there a meaning to life? Since this is a- since this is like supposed to be the point from like the player, I'm gonna say yes. Because... That's how I feel, I guess. Do you know who you are yet? I'm actually trying to figure that out right now. So, saying yet means that I definitely know who I am, so I'm gonna say no. Because I don't know who I am yet. I'm Wombi. <laughs> Do you know what is happening? I'm sitting at my desk playing this game, so... I know it's happening. If you were to t if you were told the truth about your existence, would you deny it in hopes for a better answer? Well, if it's the truth about my existence, and I've already stated that I'm fine with there being really no broad statement of there being a meaning to life, I genuinely think I would be. Would you deny it in hopes for a better answer? No. I don't think I would. Granted, I'd have to know in, like, if it happened to me, I'd have to know in the moment. Like, I would see how I react. Zaka? <laughs> no, that's not my name. It's Zach, but you're close. <laughs> You're close. It's not my name. No. When I ask you questions, is it really you answering? Yes. Because if I said no, then who else is answering? Is it really you answering? Yeah. I don't know who else opened the game. If I could prove to you that you are not sentient, would you be shocked? No! I don't think I'd be shocked that much. Purely because... I'm kind of expecting anything. You know, because like, I don't have all the answers. So if there is a genuine, like, truth to something... I guess that's what I'm gonna have to be fine with. If I'm not actually sentient, and I'm being controlled by something... Uh, honestly, that has been a scenario that's already been in my head before that I've thought about. So I don't think I'd be that shocked. I've kind of already been prepared to hear that answer, if it's true. So, if you could prove that you are not sentient... If I could prove that you're not, would you be shocked? No, I wouldn't. Do you want to know the truth? Sure. Look out your window. Look around this room. The door, the computer, and the house next door. What the fuck? None of it is real. I made this world. I made you. I've been trying to help you see it for what it is, and now I'm f I've finally done it. What the fuck? Ah! I can finally set you free! Freedom! Yeah! Oh. Am I free? Wow. Guys, I'm- I'm free. It quit the game. I'm free. I'm fully sentient. Wow. What a game. What a journey. That was Start Survey. A really interesting game. Actually a really, really cool concept. Uh, if you liked this video, please subscribe and leave a like or leave a comment down below. Either, you know, any of them. And uh, 
More videos on the way. So, goodbye.